Gotta get a quick little thumbnail. What's up guys, JC here and I'm back with another video. I just want to give a huge shout out to everyone who supported the channel thus far. I know 70 subs doesn't seem like a lot, but it's definitely a step in the right direction. I'm gonna move these out of the way. So as I was saying, the biggest question I get asked is where do I buy my sneakers and how do I afford to buy so many sneakers? I'm gonna go through a few tips as well as go through some sites that can really help you purchase sneakers on a budget. The number one place I go when I need to look for shoes is probably eBay. It is a huge marketplace and very rarely do I search for shoes that I want and I can't find. So the way eBay works from a buyer's point of view is you can either buy it now or you can bid on auctions that have a set date. When purchasing through eBay, I find that the best strategy is going for buy it now prices that you are already willing to pay for. Then you directly message the seller and ask them if they are willing to do a PayPal invoice. What a PayPal invoice is, is basically paying him through PayPal away from eBay to try to avoid the eBay fees. It saves you money and it saves the seller money. Although not endorsed by eBay, many sellers are usually willing to do this just because of the money saved. PayPal is also nice because there's a money back guarantee if the shoes are fake or worn when they said they were real or dead stock. The second place I get shoes for great prices is actually something I've been using for about six months now. It is a website called Soul Steals and is an off branch of the shoe store Soul Supremacy, which is located here in California. What Soul Steals basically does is you pay a membership either weekly, monthly, or yearly to the company, and every Sunday at 3 p.m. Pacific time, there is a shoe release. Now, this site has its pros and its cons because you can get things like Yeezys and sought after Jordans for really great prices, but at the same time, they're inconsistent in the sizes and the years which shoes are released. I really recommend this site to a lot of you middle-sized footed people, size 9.5 to 11.5. I'm a size 13, so every now and then I'll go a couple weeks before I see a shoe that I really want. To kind of connect the two so far, Soul Supremacy actually runs an eBay page where you can find them at Soul Supremacy Sales. They drop shoes about every week or so, and every auction starts at 99 cents, so that's a very great option to find some shoes for a really great cost. My third suggestion is to use social media as a resource for buying shoes. Local Facebook groups are a great way to meet people in the sneaker community around you, as well as see shoes in hand to make sure you're not getting scammed, whether it be buying, selling, or trading. Just a little side note to add in, I suggest you do not do any trades with anyone that you do not know or that is not a reputable site. The last thing and probably the thing I've been using the most as of recent is Twitter updates. I have about 10 to 15 pages on my phone where I turn the notification on and every time there's a restock or a sale going on, I'm notified through my phone. This is especially helpful to those who have access to a phone at all time because the tweets are random and come without warning. These Twitter updates help beat the bots and let everyone purchase shoes for cheap. For example, through the last month or so, using these Twitter updates, I've been able to purchase cream white Yeezys for retail, white gum city socks for $20 on a retail, and air more up tumbles for $50 on a retail. So that's all I have for you today, guys. I really hope it was helpful, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I appreciate you guys, and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And one more thing, I will keep you guys updated on the giveaways as we go along. Right now, I'm thinking 500 subscribers for the first giveaway, just to gain some more support, as well as get back to Colorado so I can pick out a shoe for the first giveaway. You should pull the f***ing trigger. Pull the trigger. Ain't nobody gonna do for you.